Welcome to the backyard. Head over to the garage to play the solo play quests. Want to dive right into multiplayer? Activate the multiplayer portal. Jump in the customization booth to try a new character. Is this like a freaking RPG town? For plants versus zombies? Oh hey, do you like my hiding spot? Hide and find is my favorite game. One of my friends is hiding in a secret spot. Do you want- I'm just talking to a bush. Let's go. Actually, that, should, that shouldn't be that surprising. This is plants versus zombies. Do I- do I even have anything like a main menu? Or like, is this like, this replaces the menu? The dandelion has a quest for me. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I saw a pea shooter come out of that customization boot the other day. He's my favorite plant. He's so cool. There's a lot of boots. The freaking like, I'm trying to just get my bearings and the game is like, no, you're playing a game. Get going. What's Agent P? Okay. Oh god, I have to just spend 150,000 coins if I want him. I think I unlocked him for a fraction of that price before, but alright, I mean, he's free for a week. I think we're going like a League of Legends Riot Games here. Your biggest fan. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. He's dead. Wait, Deluxe Edition? How clever! You've purchased the Garden Warfare 2 Deluxe Edition. Aren't you bright for giving Uncle EA more of your hard-earned cash? You're so smart, give yourself a pat on the back. Run out of pots and bots. That costs more compared to the first game. It was only a thousand coins before. Okay, they want you to spend your money in this one. The maximum in the last one was 10 euro. Best value, diamond tier. You're a sucker if you only buy 2 million coins for 45 euro. Oh, they display your skins. That's actually kind of cute. So I have like this P and Agent P at the moment. Okay, we'll just do we'll just do welcome that. We'll get our, we'll get our start in the world. I Okay, good match. <laughs> uh thanks server coordinator, appreciate it. We're just a tiny little bugger. With like <laughs> Freaking Uzis. Okay, I can spin. I just keep spinning, apparently. Alright. So, like, I have Reaver's ult as my tree ability. I, the, oh, they got freaking Reinhardt's on their team. Overwatch May 2016, Plats vs. Zombies, Garden Warfare 2, February 2016. Do you think Blizzard looked at this game releasing in, like, February? Like, all of their lead designers gathered around on a table with, like, Jeff Kaplan. He just, like, stumbles into the office is like, oh shit, guys. They did it. Everything we've been working on is for not. The pirate character is literally just a small roadhog. But that means roadhog is literally just a big pirate character because this came first. Also, oh, Battleborn. Ah, we don't talk about Battleborn. <laughs> is it just me or does the chili bean look a lot more stoned in this game too as my one ability? He's been, uh, he's been having a good time. Between garden warfares. <laughs> With my freaking how many kills have I got? Oh god, wait, wait, wait. Voice chat isn't on, is it? They just hear the rambles of a streamer without his audience. It's like, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, guys who played like trying to relax after work. You know, just going about your day. <laughs> We've just like left like our mic on while we're doing a live stream or trying to record a YouTube video. Like these guys are listening to me doing like four different intros. What's up gamers at- Oh no I stuttered. How's it going Gamer Nation? And like they just have to endure it. You need to make your own name for your fan base. Was well, is, is that like my army? It's, pro it's probably like the RT gamers. This is what happens when you uh, when you joke about that too much. You have to start using like a non-ironic context. We've become what we always hated. Like we're we're now that type of YouTuber who refers to his audience as like Gamer Nation. Because we've done it ironically so many times. It's surrounded by zombies, let's get rid of them. Yeah, so is there an actual story? Or is this just like a means for me to learn some mechanics and kind of like an advanced tutorial? What is 1 plus 2 if it had bark? I lied, I'm toast. You fond of secret organizations? Not sure. If by chance you were invited to become a member of a secret organization, would you accept? Gladly accept, possibly. <laughs> this is just random, like... 
Did anyone ask for this? I like plants vs. zombies, but you know what I also like? Skyrim. Grumpy stole plants from Dr. Zomboss, evil leader, evil zombie leader and famous cooker of foods. Golden plan reveals under Zomboss' plan for build an ultimate power of universe. Now Grumpy have to get plants to Dave bought 3,000, he know what to do. Okay, well let's do the escort quest. I, I feel like I'm gonna need some friends. <laughs> or this is just gonna be like a bit of a lonely experience. I think the bad first impression from this in comparison to the other one, because the other one was just straight up just, I went into the packs, it was microtransactions in my face. And I was wondering like, what, like, what the fuck's going on? Like, how bad does this go? Uh, like, I think this one is the fucking hub world and the story that's, like, bothering me more than anything. Because, like, 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 who cares? Who, honest to God, cares? If Plants vs. Zombies has a story. Did Plants vs. Zombies ever get a movie? If not, at least that pitfall was avoided. That's gonna happen next, isn't it? Like, it's gonna be Illumination. Illumination, like, the minions, guys. The, the, I, that's totally gonna happen. I, I'm putting money on that. Real question for all you here. When are we getting the Fortnite movie? Because you just know that's gonna be like a fully animated production. One man's quest to get the battle royale. And he's like against a hundred other players. And you know, you get all your quirky characters on the battlefield. Like there's only four players left on the map and he's gained control of Tilted Towers. Okay, let's team up as friends, gags. You want a gag? I know he has like the AR assault rifle, but we, we can take him. Because we believe in each other. They completely misunderstand the premise of Fortnite is that there can only be one winner. That could be made by Illumination too. <laughs> but they've embraced the time travel element from like the second game more as well, haven't they? Maybe that's why the microtransactions are worse in this one compared to gar the original Garden Warfare. Because the source reference for this is Plants vs. Zombies 2. But the source for the first one is the original Plants vs. Zombies. For the most part. Top bad thanks for five quid. I just found out it's Pride Month, so I'm changing my last message to Big Homo. <laughs> it's like, no homo. It's like, oh, wait a minute. It's that time of year. Oh, the fucking homo. <laughs> like, let me clarify my last message. <laughs> How many minutes can you live before you get murdered? Let's find out. Start the clock. Start the... Don't start the clock. Okay, how long was that? Oh, you want epic maneuver time. It missed. It missed most of them. <laughs> Damn it. The, like, barrage stopped the moment we were over them. So they just saw me, like, jump most of that. Is RT single-handedly reviving dead games? What a saint. The, I, the, I'm hearing that, like, almost with every game I play these days. Like, even, like, the fucking comments on the dogs. it's like, half of them are just people saying, like, I'm gonna go check on my dogs and like play this again. And I just I find that really weird. <laughs> I think it's just a bunch of people games that people forgot about, but like actually have fond memories of it. And you know they're old, but like we still have good memories of them. We just kind of moved on to playing like you know the Fortnite G Royale Plants versus Overwatch. We're just playing sport ball now as well. Like what's going on? Unironically love this game. Yeah, it's actually a pretty good game. I got off to a bad first impression again because like the fucking hub world um, so That seems just kind of unnecessary to me I think it's just like my general attitude to like a lot of these games where like, I just want to play the game and I don't I Don't really care about the experience. It's trying to craft just like let give me the game and let me create the experience from that I don't care about framing devices or anything like that like especially in a game like this because like this game doesn't need it this game does not need a plot to, like, fight the zombies. This apology video is brought to you by Audible.com. <laughs> Could you imagine the nerve of someone to actually have to do, like, an apology video and then, like, get it sponsored? Guys, I'm really sorry for what I did. And Loot Crate is also sorry that you're, you're gonna have an amazing... Parcel of loot in your post soon. Order today using the coupon code. I'm sorry <laughs> For all your gamer gear merch <laughs> Like the fucking balls you'd have to <laughs> It's like like the video name is like we need to talk and then like top line the video is like 
get 10% off your first order on Audible or something. Hey guys, what's up? It's, it's like Daniel here. Uh, today's video is literally just seven sponsorships. And then the video ends. We are literally just gonna plug things. We're not even gonna tell you about them. We don't have time. And then there's like ads between the sponsors. Just for good measure.